Hello you beautiful people and welcome back to Let's Play Warhammer 40k Mechanicus in the next round. And here the last episode actually ended a dead um, Skitari. So what can you skin? Okay, I guess he has not everything is um, replaced. But anyhow, um, caution. Leave the body alone. Shoot down the body from a distance. If it's a trap, it should be deactivated. So other Skitari do not get caught out by it. Take out the body and examine it. Oh, 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 that was not good at all. One of the troopers volunteers to pull the body down. Hit Necron devices, catch the trooper in a blast of harmful radiation that hits him directly and adversely affects the rest of the cohort too. The body is destroyed and the cohort is left, left with um, debilitating injuries and yet another reason to despise, to despise the Necrons. Oh yeah. So the only thing we can go is there that we should do. We have another glyph there, that's quite nice. I definitely have to heal up one, heal up one um, Necron, uh, one, um, one Tech Priest there. Opportunity for study, recovery, exploration, goal, um, equals um, vivisection, recover if possible. One flayed one is trapped in a malfunctioning doorway. Its lower limbs are crushed, but it has not been damaged enough to cause its teleportation protocols to engage. Rabbi of the neck one teleporting away, try to retrieve only its gory covering skin. Attempt to recover the flayed one intact. No flayed one can truly be safe. Destroy the Xenos with flame. That I will do. Um, disappointment detected, disapproval protocols engage. And Necron reanimate one turn faster is the nice one. Deflate one is immolated with in, um, incendiary charges and reduced of scraps of charged shard skin and melted metal. The process is rapid enough for the cohort to make good time advancing through this area. Avoid the further, avoid the further attention of deflate ones. Okay. It didn't actually work as I intended it, but anyhow, sometimes that you just can't change. So we have another glyph. I'll open it up. A single port design of what Necron cannot take creature extrude some device. Oh, we have found something nice. Single target melee attack knocks back the target by one tile. Deals three physical damage. Okay, nice. Um, what is cool of the not backward I should um, at least try out is to knock enemies um, out of or over a border. Extra Necrons in battle. I can't change that. That's weird. If this is being used by the Flayed One, it needs to be closed. The court comes across a side tunnel went to uh, in the tomb wall. The entrance to the passageway is cl clotted with blood and scraps of flesh, suggesting it is used as a way for the flayed ones to move around the tomb. Skull. Dose the passageway with the flame before doing anything else. Close the passageway without delay. Check what's inside the passageway before acting. I search and get command point. The entrance opens not into a navigable passage, but a clogged mass of bone and decaying biological tissue. The sight is horrifying, but at least means the vent is not being used by the flayed ones after all. This is a little cons consolation to the cohort who will, whose will is shaken by the gruesome discovery. All right, um, the nice part is we have full cognition. Um, that is really nice, and that could theoretically be the last deployment or the last fight for this mission at least it is the last um, deployment for this little episode um, okay only flayed ones so that is good for us um, how will I actually technically do it I want to have the big gun at front so to say let's put them all like that and I will call in one of these guys because elsewise I would I think um, waste one cognition point when our first buddy is awakening so I need okay they're already in close combat that is too bad 
three damage done to us. Not very nice. Two damage done there. Not nice. So I need. They are not in range, are they? Oh, good lord. So only two get over. So what I will have to try out to lay him first of all is this the. Okay, I will try something out, you guys. And I hope that I will not hit my own guys. Damage absorbed, very, very nice, but... Two damage done, okay, okay, fair enough. I can take that, I think. I hope I will... No, I won't hit my own guys, that is very nice. So that was kind of easy. And then I'll go here. I will push him away. Like so. And then use the servo skull to get some cognition. Bring me to four even move there and use that to heal myself up. Three damage repaired, that is good, that is nice. So that was a beautiful move of him this round. So he has the master cannon, that is quite amazing. Take him down. The question is, are the Necrons in out of range? Okay. So let me move him right there and then they should be in range actually. Blaster, shoot please and take him out of his misery so to say. That one is down. Uh, ba -ba -ba -bum. You heal yourself. And now I will even try something out what happens if I do that. Okay, I thought I could kill him. Okay, yes, not the servo skull which does damage, I assume. Alright, there was him. Auto repair, so he's at full. He's at full throttle, so to say. You go there. You, first of all, are going to heal yourself up. Three, better than nothing. You will get some cognition back. And then overall shoot this bad boy. Okay, that was good. Because with my little bugger on the other side, I can take him out hopefully. Or at least one of those two guys, if anything, is in range. That would be quite cool. Out of range. Okay, that was too bad. Um, then we give it up. Let's put it to them neck ones. So they probably are going to... Oh, no, they will... Of oh, no, no, no. We are in a little bit of trouble here. That is um, one concept not... I don't want to complain here. Don't get me wrong. I hate complaining but it's a little thing which is a little confusing if you think about the um, Warhammer universe and the Necrons with their really low initiative then we should always have the term before them that is just my weird thinking there but anyhow So then you take him out. I have the aggro, I guess, as well. Okay, that was critical, no cool. So you, you, you beautiful my, my, my what? I don't know what I'm sometimes saying, guys, sorry. You will punch him away. Until he disintegrates and then shoot. Well, that is the big ass question. What do we do? 
let's actually shoot this guy. But that, guys, actually brings us to the end of this episode. And you know it, I, as usual, really thank you for watching. If you have enjoyed this episode, guys, then please give me a thumbs up and subscribe. And hopefully I'll see you in the next episode. Until then, have a nice day. Stay frosty. Bye.